In this tutorial, we'll look at adding pictures to PagePlus publications. This is really easy to do and is great for enhancing your designs. I've started a new publication and I've already added a background. Now we can add some pictures. One way of doing this is to add pictures to the Pictures category on the Assets tab. This ensures that you can quickly access your pictures when you want to and add them to the page. At the bottom of the Pictures category, click Add. Now you need to navigate to your pictures. I've already copied some pictures from my camera into my Pictures folder on my computer, so I'll navigate here. To select multiple pictures, hold down the Control key on your keyboard while you click on the pictures that you want to use. When you're happy, click Open and you'll see your pictures appear in the Pictures category. A great way of presenting your pictures in PagePlus is to add them to digital picture frames. These give your pictures a professional touch and look really effective. If I open the Picture Frames category on the Assets tab, you can see that I've already added some frames, which I will use in this publication. To add more picture frames, just click Browse. For more information, see the Assets for Amazing Page Content video tutorial. In PagePlus, picture frames are colour schemed. They will update to match the current colour scheme of your publication when added to the Assets tab. If you want to change the colour scheme of your publication, Open the Schemes tab at the bottom right of your workspace and choose a different scheme from the list. The colour of affected picture frames will then automatically update in the Picture Frames category. OK, first we'll add the picture frames to the page. To do this, click on a frame and then drag it out onto the page. The frame will be placed at its default size. Simply drag on the corner handles to resize it if required. Now we can continue to add picture frames to our publication. It's really easy to change the way that picture frames are positioned. First select a picture frame and then use the corner handles to resize it and the rotation handles to rotate it. You can also use the buttons on the Arrange toolbar to reorder the picture frames. The next thing to do is to add pictures to the frames. From the Pictures category in the Assets tab, select a picture and then drag it onto your frame. When the inside of the frame changes colour, release the mouse button. Repeat this process until all of your picture frames are filled with pictures. I'd like to replace the picture in this frame. To do this, you can either drag a different picture onto the frame from the Assets tab, or use the Replace Picture button on the control bar below the frame. Just click this button, navigate to your pictures, and select the one you want to use. When you click Open, the new picture will appear inside the frame. Before we finish, we'll look at adding creative effects to picture frames. With the picture frame selected, click Effects at the right of the workspace to open the Effects tab. Next, select an effect from the list or use the Choose Effects button to view more effects. Click the Enable Disable button next to the name of your chosen effect. You can then adjust the effect by moving the sliders below. Well, that's it! I hope you've enjoyed exploring the basics of using pictures in your publication and giving them a stylish look. To find out more about PagePlus, see the Learn section of the Startup Assistant. Thanks for watching!